So recently I needed to create lots of React projects to test different things and every time I had to go through this same and tedious process of adding all the tools that I need for the project. But then I asked myself, why not create a starter template with all the necessary tools and dependencies already installed and configured? That way I can save both mine and your time and energy for more important things. So today I'm going to show you how I made this starter template. You can use it right now by clicking the link in the description to the GitHub repository and there's also instructions on how to use it. This template has React with TypeScript because I think TypeScript is something that's an essential for every modern project. I've also added Tanstack query with Axios. Axios is an optional dependency that I like to use instead of fetch, but Tanstack query is an absolute must if we want to do some heavy client-side networking. We also have Tailwind here because I always use Tailwind for any styling problems that I have, and I think it's the most optimal solution right now. This template also comes with class names and Tailwind Merge, which actually solves a huge problem that's commonly occurring when using Tailwind, and that's overriding some class names. And last but not least, we need ESLint and Prettier. We need code linting and code formatting, and that's why I've added these two packages. ESLint comes with pre-configured Airbnb ESLint config, because I always follow their conventions. And Prettier also comes with the Tailwind class sorting, which gives us these beautiful sorted class names so that we don't have different order in different places. I've also added relative imports. It's not a package. It's an essential if we want to use modern imports where example we won't have to import something with slashes and dots we can just add a directive at and the folder and then we can import anything we need all of this combined helps me just clone the repo do an npm install and start working on what i need without being bothered by the same installation process every time now of course every project is unique so feel free to customize the starter template as needed you can add and remove dependencies change the project structure and even modify the default configuration files to suit your specific requirements. So there you have it. My V3 React starter template is here to save you time and energy when creating new projects. I hope this video has given you a good overview and you can find this starter template actually useful and you can use it in your project. Also, please leave suggestions in the comments on what you'd like to see and also thumbs up other people's comments if you agree with them on what I should add or should remove and take care.